In this video, I'm going to teach you how to use a Logitech G29 on Roblox. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up a steering wheel, specifically the Logitech G29 model, and use it within Roblox. So, while it is possible for you to use a steering wheel on games such as Roblox, you will have to download an additional tool because Roblox does not have native steering wheel support. So, what you have to do is download a controller emulator. The one that I recommend in this video is this one, X360CE. So the Xbox 360 controller emulator. As the name suggests, all this is going to do is get the inputs from the steering wheel and it is going to translate them into Xbox inputs. Essentially, Roblox can understand these inputs better, so you will be able to use your steering wheel this way. So go over to x360c.com and don't worry, regardless of the model of steering wheel that you have, even if it's one developed for PlayStation, you will still be able to set it up. So download this tool for free. So download for all games here and just follow the instructions. You will be able to extract this anywhere or you can extract it in the Roblox folder if you prefer. So open the zip file and then run this executable file. Now, inside of X360CE, the first thing that you will have to do is set up your controller. So, choose the option to add a controller at the right side of the screen on the plus side, and you will be able to select the Logitech G29 steering wheel, and as long as it is properly connected to your PC and up to date with the latest firmware. Once you select this steering wheel, you will see this icon of an Xbox controller, don't worry, this is normal, and all that you have to do now is move your steering wheel all the way to the left, all the way to the right, and use the paddles. Every time that you do this, you will see these numbers change, indicating that the inputs are being detected. So all that you have to do is click on stick axis x for example and then move your steering wheel all the way to the left when you choose record then do the same for the other side and you can do the same on the triggers so the trigger on the right is going to be the accelerator so press on trigger choose the option to record and then press down on it and just repeat the same for all the buttons y x b a and so on once you set up each individual control you will be able to choose the option to add game select the roblox player or launcher and now you can go inside of any experience that has support for these steering wheels and you will be able to drive around so go ahead and join any experience that has steering wheel support and you will be able to play using your logitech g29 as long as you set up each individual input i hope i was able to help you on how to use a logitech g29 on roblox if this video helped you please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips thank you for watching